committee, man, I appreciate the acknowledgement tonight. You know, for me, man, the longer I do this, the more I just love doing it. So being able to get up every day and, and do what I love for a living is really enough of a reward in and of itself, you know. But this right here now, man, this is the proverbial icing on the cake. Gorgeous. And the award is also. Just a couple quick acknowledgements here, man. Uh, first, uh, to my bandmates, Lita Ford, Patrick Kennison, Marty O'Brien. These are my fellow road warriors, and I have the privilege of getting out with these guys almost every week, destroying villages around the globe. That's an inside joke. I'd also like to acknowledge my longtime drum tech, Cubby Hubschmidt. And uh, I'll tell you, man, 2018 marks 30 years that the Cub and I have been working together. And uh, so, yeah, he's, he's the best of the best. He's a lifelong friend. Wish he could be here tonight, uh, but he was already booked on another gig, ironically. <laughs> anyway, here's another 30 with the Cub. And last but not least, I just wanted to acknowledge all the great teachers I've had through the years. Uh, Randy May, Ed Kaspik, Lenny Nelson, Craig LeMay, and a special shout out to my very first band director, Miss Mary Thompson from Houston, Texas. I had her from probably sixth grade on through most of my high school years. Phenomenal teacher. She really instilled that you know old school uh, work ethic in me from an early age about the importance of always trying to get in the practice room, always try to take the craft to the next level. And it's something that's really stayed with me through the years, you know? And she also reminded me or told me back then that, you know, it doesn't matter how many changes go on in the industry, how many different styles of music come and go. She taught me that, you know, good musicianship never goes out of style. So, to all my teachers, I want to share this award. And uh, again, man, thank you guys very much tonight. Thank you.